All right, y'all. This video is gonna be out of New Jersey. This is gonna be about a New Jersey corrections officer that was suspended over his comments on Facebook about five-year-old uh, Cannon Hunt that was murdered by the black male. Now, um, Roman Smith, who works at the Cumberland County Juvenile Detention Center, wrote on Facebook Friday about the August 9th shooting that killed Cannon Hunt as a boy rode his bike outside the family's outside his family's home. He should have ducked Smith. 49 a registered vote. Y'all trying to sneak this and discredit a black person being killed instantly by police. Blame Ken's parents for not watching him. F y'all. Um, now Smith's Facebook account appeared to be no longer available. Early Wednesday, county officials did not identify him by name, but confirmed the suspension and they announced the online comments are shocking and sensitive and racist in tone. Now, before I go any further, okay. Um, obviously he's probably talking about George Floyd. Um, Everybody's talking about George Floyd, okay? But, honestly, did the knee on the neck kill George Floyd? Okay, um, now don't get me wrong. Well, obviously, what happened to George Floyd is not police protocols, not police tactics, okay? Um, it's not. Um, you don't, you don't put your knee on someone's neck, especially a handcuffed male. Could the, could Derek Chauvin have done more to stop this, you know, if he, if George Floyd was crashing on drugs, which he probably was, you know, there's not, I mean, he was probably crashing on drugs, and that's what ultimately killed him, okay? Did the knee on the night play a part of it? You know, who knows, okay? Um, it's obviously not police tactic and not part of protocol to do that, but the biggest part of why he died was because of the drugs in his system, and people are honoring him like he was viciously murdered, but... Like, y'all getting putting up holograms him giving him his family a full American flag. The only people that should be getting full American flags are fallen service members, fallen police officers, and fallen first responders. Those are the only people who should be getting fallen, uh, full American flags, not George Floyd. Um, now, we will not tolerate county employees who use social media to broadcast hateful messages. Cumberland County Freeholder Director Joseph Durrell said, This is not who we are, and we tend to pursue the strongest action available to us. Now, I don't know if they can actually charge him with anything. Again, some of y'all are in law enforcement on here, so y'all would know more than me. Um, now, Smith, who is black, cannot be reached for comment Wednesday. He has not been enrolled. He has been enrolled in the state's pension system for 26 years. Uh, Smith's post was screwed and racism very disturbing by those who spotted it online, including some who suggested that others let his workplace know about his thoughts on the fair shooting of Cannon, who was white. He is obviously racist against Caucasians. One post read, he laughed at a five-year-old boy being executed. Now, um, there are people um, inside the group Black Lives Matter that are making jokes about this. Um, they are posting bikes, um, like those in the For Sale Wanted group and Facebook. People posting bikes, talking about, you know, um, he, obviously he don't need it because he was killed. Um, you know, more black people need to do this to white people. Okay, first of all, you know, anybody who condones this, you know, there's really no words. Y'all just need to get your life together. Y'all are a sad excuse for a human, okay? Like, y'all condoning murder on a, another person because y'all so brainwashed by the media. Don't believe everything you see on the media, okay? Just like this whole coronavirus thing, don't believe everything you see on the media. Um, you know... Like, you can't just sit there and be okay with this. Like, this little boy was killed, shot in the head, in front of his two sisters. I believe they were seven and eight. Okay. Like, not only is he dead, but they have to live with the fact that he's dead and the fact that they sat there and watched it. That he was killed for no reason. And people are condoning this and that, like, it's okay. And when it's, it's not okay. Now, at no point is this okay. Now, I don't know where people are getting this from. Like, anybody who condones this or thinks this is okay, it's part of the problem in America. Now, one more thing. Um, I know there will probably be some trolls on here that will be like, Oh my God, so you don't support the police after all? Okay, no, I do support the police. Okay, I'm not going to judge one officer out of 200 good officers. Okay? Um, and if you don't like the police, then there's no point on you being on my channel. But with that being said, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. As always, y'all stay safe and thank y'all for watching.